Thank you. Dozens of kids exposed to pepper spray at school. It happened this morning just after 10 o'clock at Lamar Middle School in North Austin. KXAN's Gary Cooper is there now live and has more on what happened there today, Gary. Yeah, first and foremost, no one was seriously hurt, thankfully. Still, it can cause inflammation to your eyes, nose, and lungs. It is one of the most painful burning experiences that anyone can go through. And AISD says a student brought pepper spray to Lamar Middle School. In a letter, in a letter sent to parents, Lamar's interim principal said a student sprayed the stuff in a hallway, and the spray somehow got to about 26 students. One student told us some of the spray managed to get into some of the air conditioning vents. After everyone was treated, the school went back to normal. Some of the students were picked up as soon as their parents could get here. Others stayed behind, and some parents were simply scared to death. Well, your heart drops, you know. You see so many negative things in the news already, um, you know, with schools, things going on. And the, the message I got from him was, you know, scary. Just mom, somebody gassed the school, you know, because he didn't know what was going on. All he knew was that he was burning and he couldn't breathe, so scary. Now, just how did the student get their hands on the pepper spray? Well, AISD did not say when we asked him that question. Now, what sort of punishment will this student or students face? Well, according to AISD, thanks to federal laws in place, that information is not made public. Still, bottom line, everyone is okay from this pepper spray incident, if you will, that happened at Lamar Middle School. We're in North Austin. Gary Cooper, KXAN News. Gary, thanks. Pepper spray stimulates the eyes to produce tears, but what is it exactly? An oil called oleoresin capsaicin is the main component of pepper spray. Capsaicin is an inflammatory agent in the oil. That's the same chemical that adds the heat in chili peppers, but there's a lot more of it in pepper spray. Here's a closer look at just how much more. On the Scoville heat unit scale, a bell pepper measures zero, a jalapeno pepper measures 2,500 to 5,000. Commercial pepper spray comes in about 2 million units, and the one used for self-defense, like the ones used by police, 5.3 million Scoville units.